Hello and welcome to the 2324 school year orientation for the Lewis Fraser Middle School Media Center. You will find your media center off of the Commons area to the right and just past the cafeteria lunch serving lines. My name is Lori Stanfield and I am your media specialist. Now let's make our way towards and into the media center so that you can take a quick look around and see what we have to offer. Once you enter into the media center, over to your left and all around the media center, you are gonna see what we refer to as flexible seating options. We have some movable furniture in the media center which you are welcome to use. However, we ask that you put it back where you found it once you're done. As you come in the media center and move around the corner to the right, you will find Miss Roses. She's our media specialist para and she is here to help you. Whether it's to check out a book or to help you with an iPad issue, stop by her desk and ask for help and she will be more than happy to help you out. Now let's take a look around the media center and see what we have to offer. As we look around the media center, you see the furniture we talked about, and then you will see the different sections of books. As you first come in the media center, there you can see the door that you enter, and you see these semi-circle bookshelves. These bookshelves contain books that are new, newly ordered and newly shelved books that we have ordered for our students to read. Then as you pan around the media center, you'll see the fiction section. The fiction section is alphabetized by author's last name from A to Z. As you can see, we have a, a large selection of fiction books for you to check out and read. Our fiction books are arranged in alphabetical order by author's last name. On the spine of each book, you will see the first few letters of the author's last name. And of course, these start with A and go all the way through Z. As you keep going past the fiction section, you will round a corner and you will see some more semi-circle bookshelves. These semi-circle bookshelves, you will want to know that this is where our most frequently checked out books are housed. We used to call this section All the Rave because this contained graphic novels and other books that were frequently checked out by our student population. Along the short side and back wall, you will find our non-fiction books. These books are arranged by the Dewey Decimal System, and as you look around on the top of the shelf, there will be um, printed posters that help you know what section to look in for specific topics that you're looking for. Um, for example, if you're looking for a book on technology or engineering, you would look in the 600s. If you're looking for a science-related book, you would look in the 500s. And if you're looking at graphic arts, music, and sports, you'll want to look in the 700s. So check out our nonfiction area to find all kinds of information on different topics that you're looking for. And just in front of our nonfiction section, over to the right, you're gonna find biographies. Biographies are arranged in alphabetical order by author's name as well. The next section of books that you'll see is the series section. And you'll find the series section on um, part of the back wall and then on the front wall of the media center as well. In the series section, you will find series such as the Maze Runner series, The Throne of Glass series, another series, Daughters of the Moon, along with many, many more popular series of books. These are books you will want to read in order, starting with number one, then moving to the second book, then the third. This last section of books under the windows of the Media Center contains reference books, books in different languages, and some overflow from our series section and our fiction section. So if you can't find a book that you're looking for in fiction or in all the rave or in our new book section, come ask us to help you and we may be able to help you locate it under the windows. Now that you've had a virtual tour of the Media Center and know what we have
have to offer and here are some important rules that you will need to know that I want to let you know. Number one, in order to come to the Media Center, you must have a pass from your teacher. If more than one student is coming from the class, you both need separate passes. One pass, one student. Two passes, two students. Another thing that you need to know is that we do not allow book bags or purses to come in the Media Center. So when you come to check out a book, do not bring these items with you. If you do, you're going to be asked to set them outside of the door. You'll be able to check out two books at a time, however only one book will be able to be a graphic novel. We have a limited supply and want to make sure that we keep enough for everyone. You'll be able to keep both books that you check out for a period of two weeks. You're responsible for turning in your books when they're due. If you have books that are overdue, you will not be allowed to check out additional books until you take care of turning in the overdue books. If you damage a book, you are responsible for the damage. So please keep these things in mind. We want to protect our books and have them available for students to check out, so please take care of them when you have them and return them in the same condition that you found them. We look forward to you visiting us in the Media Center this school year. And now that you have watched the orientation, we will be able to begin book checkouts. So we look forward to seeing you.